Hey, hello everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're starting it a bit differently because um, this part that you're watching right now is a voiceover and the only reason it's a voiceover and not actually recorded with my voice in real time is because this was recorded at 1am um, right after I got home from my evening shift and I didn't want to wake my mom up but I did want to make a start on unboxing these packages. So yes, that's why it's a voiceover. So what you're watching right now is me taking everything out of the box and in a little bit I will also take all the bubble wrap off. Um, yeah, right here. It's, it's, it's a lot. Also ignore the cable in the top of the screen. I didn't, should have checked that, but I didn't. It was 1am so <laughs> I wasn't really um, very awake. But yeah, like I said, I wanted to get started with this package, so I did. So yeah, this first package contained the I've Switch albums as you can see as well as my Giro Polka albums that I ordered and my Zero Base One Solar versions, which were so heavy, by the way. It explained why the box was super heavy. I couldn't even lift it up the table. I I mean, I did, so I could, but it was a struggle. <laughs> but it was very, very heavy. Oh, and the Digipacks, I forgot about those. The Digipacks were in there as well. Uh, and some pre-order benefits that you can see here. And here I was in shock with how cute the Panda cards were, so <laughs> yes. know what this is. I should have noticed it with the sticker, but these are obviously the rest of the inclusions from my albums. <laughs> I don't know how I didn't see that, but once again, it was 1am, so I don't think my brain was functioning properly at this point. I managed to get everything out though, and this is the second package. Here I'm showing the damage on the box, which is very sad. Um, I do believe none of the albums are damaged. I checked them and none of them seem to be damaged. They all seem to be fine, so that is Perfect, great, amazing. And this is just a montage of me unboxing all those Zero Base One albums. It's a lot. It's a lot. They also gave me just a clump of bubble wrap, <laughs> what it looked like. And I'm glad they wrote PC on it because otherwise I might have thrown away. So thank you, Kayadi, for doing that. That was amazing. Anyway, we're moving on to the unboxing of the Giro Polka albums. Um, I did that as well because, like I said, I wanted to get some of this unboxing out of the way um, as I don't have much time to record. So here I'm showing the period of benefits. I did speed this clip up a little bit because I was going through it really slowly. Um, this is twice the speed that it initially was, so yeah, that's that. And I forgot these were double-sided, so that was a very cute surprise. And then moving on to the actual albums themselves. I took the plastic off because that was an actual pain uh, because of the sticker on there. I tried to do it as neatly as possible, but some of them just ripped. I literally threw a piece of plastic away because I don't keep my albums in the plastic anyway, so I figured it, it can just be one of mine. Opening this, by the way, was so scary. As you can see, I'm struggling, and that's because I was scared I was gonna rip it. I didn't, luckily, but it was kind of difficult to get out. And yeah, these are the contents of the album. We have some stickers, some some text cards, I don't know, and then we have a QR card and two photo cards. So, yes. So for the rest of this unboxing for G-Idol, it kind of turns into almost ASMR because I did want to make some comments on like what I pulled, but since it was midnight and I had to be quiet, I had to whisper. Please let me know for future unboxings if you like the whispering or if you would prefer for me to be fully quiet. Because uh, honestly, I don't know. Some people like ASMR, some people don't, so. Let me know.
So these were all the pools for G-Idol. Hey, hello everyone, it's real time me, not in voiceover anymore. And we are going to be unboxing Olive's albums right now. Uh, as you can see, I have the regular versions and the digipacks. I don't remember if they did a PLVE version for this album, but um, if so, I don't have it. I have these and I have multiple versions of all of these. So um, I will be going through all of them later and show you my pools. But first, I'm just gonna unbox every single one of them and like do like a full unboxing of them. And then I will just do the rest quickly and show you my pools. So yes, let's just go ahead and get started. So I'm gonna start with the regular versions for which I do have some pre-order benefits. I don't know if these are all in order, but we will see. Cause I have a lot more than six because I ordered multiple sets. Um, but yeah, let's just see the pre-order benefits. We're starting off with Gao. Okay, so it's, let me just get one of every single member. <laughs> so I now have one of every single member here. Uh, here is Kyle's period of benefit. They're not in order, I believe, of like age or whatever. So we're just gonna <laughs> do how they put them in the order. So this is Kyle's. And the backs are pretty simple. And we have Eugene. By the way, I just saw Ivan in the concert and Eugene, she bias wrecked me so hard. As well as I believe like everyone in that <laughs> venue, but it was crazy. Then we have Liz. She's my bias. If you didn't know, if you're new to the channel, Liz is my bias. Then we have Ray. She was on our side a lot during the concert, by the way, so that was amazing. We have Iso. And we have Wonam. I believe that's all six. Yes. So those were the pre-order benefits. Now let's go ahead and go through the albums. I'm not sure which version was which anymore by the way does it say of course it doesn't why would it so here we have the first version which is what i believe the on version so there we go here it is without the plastic on it i don't know if everything's gonna be yes it is okay everything's in front i'm just gonna put oh there's a lot of stuff in here i'm just gonna put all of this to the side for now do i have everything yes and we will go through that um, after the full unboxing. It does lay flat very nicely, which I'm very happy about because a lot of albums don't and then you need to like bend it with like force, which I hate doing. Um, but yes, this is, like I said, I believe the on version. Oh, very purple. I do like the styling for this era a lot. This is, oh no, it's not. I was gonna say this is the Digipack cover for her, but it's not, it's just a very similar photo. I like the whole thing with like the, the teaser photos, they did like this type of stuff and I really liked it. That's the lyrics, the lyrics are interpreted in a photo book, that's cool. I wonder if they did one concept per- oh. No, it's the same, it's just different lighting. Uh, I was gonna say I wonder if they did the same concept for the whole photo book or if they Change it up. Oh, we have Ray next, so we're not in age order. The styling is really cool for this though. This arrow, so. Oh, by the way, this is my favorite song. I love it so much. And hearing it live was just amazing. I wanted to do the fan chat, but my mind blanked. It just didn't, so <laughs> yeah, that was a bit of a fail. I like started and then halfway through, I, I started just mumbling stuff and I was like, yeah, no, this isn't, this isn't it. We're just gonna <laughs> pretend like that didn't happen. I don't like it when they do a lot of these like white pages though, because like that feels like such a waste. Like even photos like this are better. Like you can put the signature over here or something, because I believe that's what they do that for. So they can like put a signature, but like you can put a signature over here perfectly fine. It doesn't need to be like a whole page big, <laughs> but maybe that's just me though. I love the styling. I love the blonde highlights in her hair. That looks very cool. Also, the earring, earring, earpiece. It's just stunning. I feel like I've always has good styling. They always look very good, and they also look always um, very different for each era, which I love seeing. Also, Gaul during the concert were just like a very beautiful headpiece. Um, I don't know if I can have. Uh, I don't know if I have a picture of it, but if I do, I will put it on screen and you can see what I mean. It was just so incredible. And we have a little group picture. 
very cool this background there's so much happening <laughs> it's crazy then we have one hour wait is that the same outfit yeah it's just different lighting the lighting throws me off so much because i keep thinking they like changed their outfits but they didn't it's just the lighting If you hear some background noise, that's my parents. Um, they're sitting outside and the door is like right in front of me. So I hope the camera doesn't pick it up. But if it does, I'm sorry. I, I'm i just not going to tell them to shut up because it's just kind of rude. Because like I'm going to be filming for probably an hour. And I don't want to be like, you need to be quiet for an hour. Because that's, that's just not... No. But anyway, we are now at Liz. And I love her purple hair. It's so cute. I love that Liz always has like different hair colors, although it's usually blonde or black. But she has purple now and she did pink for, um, what was it, Love Dive? She had pink highlights in her hair, which was very cool. And I love that she has like different hair colors. Cause I feel like the rest of Ive have like black most of the time or blonde. So yes. So we have Iso. The bangs, I'm usually not a fan of these like super short bangs because I usually don't like how they look on people, but they actually really suit her. I think they actually look quite nice on her. This corset though, <laughs> I don't know what it is. I'm not the biggest fan of it, but she pulls it off. It looks like, that. oh, it's just a bunch of belts, isn't it? It looks like that, um, fabric that I used to use in like I want to say kindergarten but I was a bit older than that but like we had to do like projects and like glue fabric on it it looks like that that's what it reminds me of <laughs> and another group picture the sun just disappeared so I'm sorry if the lighting changed it'll come back hopefully in a little bit oh there it is yeah that's the lovely thing about using natural lighting. You're never gonna know what it's gonna do. Anyway, here's the CD. Let me just pull it out. It's it's just white, which matches with the album, by the way, which is all white, but yes, here's the CD. The back is just plain, <laughs> like CDs usually are. So that was the album. Now let's go through the inclusions. Um, I'm just gonna do this. Because you can't see which member it is. So we're going to do the poster first. I don't know if this is a member poster. No, it's not. Okay, it's just a group poster. Still very cute. I'm not a person that uses posters, by the way. Uh, here's the poster. My posters just end up in a bin and I don't use them. So, uh, yeah, I don't hang them on my walls. I'm very much a minimalist girly. I don't really like having busy things in my room. So, yes. Then let's do this thing. I don't know if the color gives away which member it is, but if it does, I don't know. Oh, it opens. Oh, that's cute. We got Eugene. That is so cute. I thought it was just like a flip thing, but it opens. That's really cool. So yes, we have this heart. And then let's do the photo cards. I believe this. Yes, I can feel that this one. Hello, cat. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I can feel that this one is a lenticular, so let's do that one first. With that ESO! That's so cute. I'm usually not a fan of lenticulars, because I don't know for some reason. In the past, lenticulars used to be like really big. Like I'm used to twice lenticulars, and they are just so much bigger than regular photo cards, but these are the same size as the photo card as you can see. So I don't mind them as much. And ZB1 did the same thing, which is why I also collected their lenticulars, but <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's just a twice thing. But yes, that's the lenticular. And then we have the regular photo card. Oh my god, girl! Oh my god, that's so cute. The little heart. I love that. So that's it for the first version. Then we have the black version, which I believe is the off version. Which would make sense, because if like you switch a light on, it's light. And if you switch it off, it's dark would make sense but usually <laughs> it doesn't make sense 
So there we go. Here is the next version and everything's probably... Oh, it's not. Where are the inclusions? They are right in the middle. Oh god, I just saw the lenticular. Let me just... By the way, just before we start, I love this holographic. I think I love it. I love that they added that. It makes it look very... I don't know, it makes it pop. And I love that. <laughs> oh, we have this styling. I love this styling. All with the red hair. Honestly, most people weren't able to tell apart uh, Iso, Liz, and Gaul, and I totally get that. Like, on first glance, they look very, very similar in these photos. Um, but anyway, um, I'm very sad that we didn't get a photo part of this concept because I love it and it's just very cute. We're starting with Iso, or is it Liz? <laughs> I'm already. <laughs> I think it's Liz, actually. I'm not used to seeing it without bangs. That is so... I think it's Liz. Is it Liz? I think it's Liz. <laughs> Me not being able to recognize my own bias. Oh my god. Or is it Iso? I can't tell. I need to see them next to each other for me to be able to tell. Wait. Do they both have... Yes, they do. They look totally the same. <laughs> Wait. I, th I think it's Liz. If it's not, I'm sorry. It's just very difficult. See, now that looks a lot like Iso. <laughs> I... Yeah. This is Iso, definitely. Wait. <sighs> no, it's Iso. I think... What? I'm just confused. I don't get it. I, I think it was Iso, actually. I'm just... I think it's Iso, yeah. Because, like, this picture is definitely Iso. So it would make sense that they put all of her pictures together. And then this is Liz, I think. Yeah, that's Liz. That's definitely Liz. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why did they do this? I swear to God. Okay. Yeah, that's Liz. That's Liz. Oh my God. <laughs> what a great start to this photo book. This is Wonyoung. I can recognize her. <laughs> Honestly, what can I really say about the styling? Because they all look the same. So like, <laughs> if I say something, it applies to everyone. Uh, yeah. It looks stunning though. It's just like a bit of a... What was I gonna say? Confusion? That's not... I don't know the word. My mind is blanking. I wonder why they put these like pictures with a different concept just in the middle of the red hair concept. Like, did they do that so we could tell them apart? Did they know we were gonna, like, mess up and not be able to tell them apart? And that's why they put them in? Because if so, that's, that's kind of funny. They knew what they were doing. <laughs> this is Gaul, I think. Yeah, that's Gaul. <laughs> oh! Well... Okay. <laughs> I will just blur that for the video, and then I will... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that was gonna be there. I thought I got everything, but I guess I didn't. Um, anyway, did she the shoes though. These shoes are ginormous, and I love that. I would not be able to walk in those. Oh, and now we're going to Ray. See, it's just her face. I'm able to recognize that. Like, actually, Ray's pretty recognizable. I feel like she looks the most different in all five. Like, her face is very recognizable, like I just said. Oh, she has like some black tips on her hair. That's cool. And then this, I love the little pigtails. Honestly, you know what the pixels are reminding me of, especially on this photo, of baby metal, and that's very, <laughs> I don't know, I don't know why, the pixels are just giving baby metal for some reason, especially with the bangs, and with like the things in them, I don't know, that's, that's what it reminds me of. I just saw baby metal on TV yesterday, by the way, they were at Pink Pop, and honestly, I would have loved to go to Pink Pop, but I already went to Comic Con yesterday, so I couldn't. And also, the lineup didn't seem interesting to me, 
when they announced the first people <laughs> and then I just didn't check the lineup and then they added Youngblood which is one of my favorite artists they added Baby Metal which is so cool uh, I believe Monoskin was there and Yoast was there which is I don't know I, I'm kind of sad that I didn't go but yes we are at Eugene now back to Ive <laughs> I wonder how this- is this like in their hair or is it on their ears? I wonder how that works. And then a group photo of all the red hair. So there we go, that was the photo book. How am I gonna get this out? Like this, I guess. So here's the CD. This one is black. What's the top? I think this is the top. This one is black. So yes, that was the photo book. Now let's go to the inclusions. Uh, I already accidentally saw some of the inclusions, but oh well. <laughs> Um, let's do the poster first. Oh, this one is like horizontal, vertical, the other way around. I don't know, I always confuse them. Um, I don't know if this is like fully in frame. If it's not, I will add a better picture of it. But this is the poster. And then let's go to the inclusions. Let's do this big thing first. This one is yellow, so you're definitely like member specific we got oh iso iso is yellow very cute you know what confuses me the fact that they didn't do the same colors for afterlife because eugene was like hot pink in afterlife and then this one was light pink or maybe they just made them pastel colors that could be the case i don't know because iso was yellow and she's still yellow so like that makes sense at least but yeah <laughs> there we go let's do the lenticular we got Eugen, very cute. And then lastly, the photo card, which I just accidentally saw because <laughs> I didn't know it was still in there. We have Iso, very cute. So like I said, I'm kind of sad that they didn't do the red hair for the photo cards because I love the red hair. It, I think it looks very cool and cute. Um, but yes, we have Iso's photo card. And that's it for this version. Then we have this version, which is called either switch on or switch off. I don't remember. I should have fact checked that, but we're here now, so I'm just gonna continue. Oh, and this one is matte again. I don't know why I expected it to be glossy as well, but it isn't. And let's see, where are the inclusions in the middle again? Just gonna put those to the side again. <laughs> and let's go through the album. So this one, this one is the only colorful one to pair with a Love Life one. <gasps> oh my god, I love this concept. Yes, I love this. The colors and everything. Yes, I love it. I don't know what Isol's wearing on her hair, but <laughs> it's pretty funny. Okay, I think this might be my favorite concept so far. It's, I don't know. I just love the colorful um, everything of it. And yes, it's giving a bit Y2K aesthetic. Oh, this is different. <laughs> is she like behind a curtain? I don't, I don't know. Oh, the pink, she has pink at the end of her hair. That's very cute. This hairstyle, oh my God. I just love, I, I love the styling. I think this one's my favorite. The earrings, they're ginormous. Okay, but this shot again. I don't know what this is supposed to be. I think she's behind like a curtain. It's pretty cool. She also has a butterfly. Do they all have a butterfly? I love her hair in this. I love how it's styled. It's very, very cute. Ooh, this one feels a little bit loose. Oh, she's still differently here. Was one name still differently as well? I didn't even realize. Wait. Yeah, she was. How did I not even see? Oh my god, she has a totally different... Wow, okay. Very cool.
Oh, and another concept change. Is the butterfly the concept change? I think the butterfly is the concept change. Well, these are different blue contacts. I like these one more, actually. I don't know. I just think they suit her very well. It really makes her eyes pop. Are they all wearing blue contacts for every single concept, by the way? In this particular photo book, not in the others. I didn't see if they had contacts in there. She has contacts. <laughs> I love this. This little smiley picture. That's so cute. Oh, that's very zoomed in. Wow. Okay. <laughs> that is very zoomed in. Buns, I love that. Oh my god. Again with the web page. There might be a bit more of a shadow now, but yeah. <laughs> we have Iso. She's wearing green contacts, so she's she doesn't have blue. She has green. I think that looks very good with her, actually. Like, the green really suits her. Ooh, I love this. The eye, like, stones. They look very cool. I was gonna try and lay it down, but then everything, like, flips back. So that doesn't work. This, oh my god, I love these braids and the stones. I just love the rhinestones. Every time they do like rhinestones in her makeup, I think it looks very nice. Is this the thing they have in the photo card? I just realized this might be like the blanket in the photo card. <laughs> might be the same thing. Yeah, it definitely is, because here's a clearer picture of it. Okay. <laughs> that is cool. I didn't know that was going to be in a photo book. I thought it was just an accessory for photo cards. Because, like, you know how they do, like, poses with random stuff? And, like, blankets and jackets have been, like, on the rise lately. Ooh, I like this hat. I like the hat actually a lot. These bracelets, how do you even get these on and off? I, I would be so scared that it was stuck on my arm. And a group shot. I love the butterfly they're sitting in. That's very cool. So that was the photo book. Now let's go through the CD. If I can get it out of here. Please. Oh, this one's very colorful. What is the top? Uh, according to the text, this is the top. <laughs> so that is very, very cool. I like that a lot, actually. Honestly, purple and blue are kind of my favorite colors anyway. So like this whole album, like the vibes, I love it. <laughs> and let's go through the inclusions. The photo cards are on top this time, I don't know why. But yes, let's do the poster first again. Here is the poster, it's the butterfly. That's very cool, I like that. Not that I'm gonna hang it up in my wall, but <laughs> it's, it's still very cool. And then let's do this card thing, green. Who was green? Ray was green. It's Ray! Yeah, so I think the afterlight colors actually match. I don't know why they made Eugene's pastel, but yes, we got Ray for the heart. Then for the lenticular, let's see who we got. We got Iso! Didn't we get Iso already? Yes, okay, so we have a dupe Iso. <laughs> That's pretty sad, but it's okay. I have a lot more albums to open. And then let's do the photo card. Ray! Oh my god, this is actually such a cute photo card. I love this. This is very cute. Okay, so that is this version. And then we get to the loved eye version, which is very different. It's in a box. Um, so I don't know how things are going to be like put in here, but we'll see. <laughs> Why is the plastic always so static and like hard to get off your hands? Anyway, here it is without the plastic again. I just said this says dive here. That's very cool i don't know if d-i-v-e that, that's a nice a nice touch now how do i open this um i think it's just pull this out i don't want to like break it or anything and then open like a little pizza box yes okay 
so it keeps like closing can you stay open this is what we see when we open it i don't know where all the stuff is hiding there's some postcards there's a keychain okay there's a lot going on here actually um i haven't watched any unboxings so i got like a full genuine like <laughs> first glance at the album where is the photo card oh there it is it's literally peeking out okay let me put you to the side is there anything else in here there's so much going on let me just go to the photo book first and then we can do all the inclusions that are in here so here we have the photo book it's very small it's a lot smaller than the other ones and we have the red dress concept i love these dresses actually i think they're very cute and they're kind of giving Valentine's Day, which I like. So starting off with Liz, the little bubble braids. I like the bubble braids. Also, I like doing them because they're just so much easier than braiding. For some reason, I haven't braided my hair since I was like 12. And I tried to do it again recently and I was like, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> so like bubble braids are just a very nice and easy way out. Oh, I love that we have like two members on like the same... Um, not the same page, but like the same spread. That's, that's, I like that. That's very cute. And we have Ray. She has a little tie. That's very, very cute. I feel like the makeup for this is also more like natural and well, I'm a big fan of like fun makeup. I also like seeing natural makeup every so often. I think it's very, really, very cute. This is very cute. I love, I love the styling. It's very simple, but also like very distinctive. Like it's not plain or anything it's still very cute and i like that i like it when they do like simple styling in that way and the group photo very cute very cute so that is the photo book now let's grab the box back and get everything out. Uh, I'm just gonna do the stickers first since they go at the bottom. So here we have a little sticker sheet. I used to always put stickers on my laptop, but I don't do that anymore. <laughs> Cause like I getting them off of your laptop is like so hard. So there we go. Then we have these. I think this is the CD. So let's do the CD first. It's pink. I expected it to be pink because like the whole album is pink, but it's very cute still. I love, even though like they all match, they have their own little design for like version. I really like that. And then I think these are just a bunch of postcards. So let's go ahead and go through them. It's gonna take a little bit, I think. Are they all group postcards? I am not sure. Oh, they're not all group postcards. Okay. And we have multiple per member. That's quite unusual. Usually there's like one for each member. But I like that. Maybe I personally don't collect like bigger inclusions like postcards. But for people that do this, it's very, very cute. And they do one sideways. Do they do that for every member? If so, that's very nice if you use like three pocket pages because the one on the top is always sideways. And I hate to have to put postcards sideways. It's just not, not the vibe. So you can put like a page for every member and then the sideways one can go on the top. That works like perfectly. I love it when companies do like thought out things like that. Maybe they didn't even think about it and they were like, Let, yeah, let's just do one sideways. But <laughs> I don't know. Oh, we already have Liz's sideways one. Liz has two sideways, really. <laughs> right when I said I love when they do thought out things like that. Of course, <laughs> she has to be the one to not be cohesive with the rest. Okay. And 
And then, I don't know if we did these group pictures already. Yes, we did. Okay. So that's all of the postcards. Very good. Oh, the backs. The backs are pretty much the same. Uh, it's just the difference in if they're sideways or not. I forgot to show that. Then we have a little keychain. We have the photo card. So let's see who it is. It's Gao. That's so cute. I love that. So those were the regular albums. Now we can move on to unboxing the Digibax. And I once again have some pre-order benefits. So let's open those first. These are the Starship Square pre-order benefits. And I'm just gonna go like this. We're starting with ESO. This is very different styling. Is this one of the concepts from the photo book? I don't know. But yes, we have ESO. And then we have Liz. Mm -hmm. She's wearing black, that's different. And Ray. Go. And Yujin. Was that all of them? I think it was the whole list up. I just realized. That's crazy. <laughs> so that's all the pre-order benefits for these albums. And yeah, let's just go ahead and unbox. So starting off with Yujin. Okay, I got the plastic off. <laughs> so here is what the inside looks like. A little group picture. Then over here is the CD. Oh, it's silver. That's cool. And the photo book is in here. Oh, with a little poster, it seems like. Oh, it says the name on it. <laughs> well. <laughs> Is the photo card in here? Yes, it is. So here is Eugene's photo book. This is so tiny, but it's so cute. They put the lyrics in here as well. That's interesting. I love this braid, I like the long braid. I think it's very cool. Sideways shot. This outfit though, these like, I want to say sequins, but they're more like metal pieces almost. And ending with a group shot. Very cute. I put the album to the side, let me get that back. <laughs> then let's go do the poster. I already saw the name on it, so there we go. We got Gao for the poster. So it's not the member you get or the inclusions you get, because some groups do that, some groups don't. It's not the case for I've, <laughs> clearly. And photo card, let's see what we get for the photo card. We got Ray, that's cute. That's very cute. Okay, there we go. Then we have Gal's version next. And I think it's the same on the inside for every version. And I think the CD is the same as well. Yeah, I'm pretty much, that's pretty much sure that's the same so i'm not going to show it for every single album let's just get the photo book and the inclusions out of there and then let's do a little flip through again the earpiece again it's so big <laughs> it's just cool the shoes wow those are some ginormous shoes, oh my god. Also sideways shot. And ending with the group shot. So that was the gal's photo book. Then let's move to the poster. Poster? Yeah, I think it's a mini poster. So for the poster we got, oh we got Liz! Yeah, we got a Liz poster. That's very cute. It's kind of folding up, it's not laying flat, but that's okay. And then for the photo card, let's see. We got Gal, oh so we got Gal, we got, no. <laughs> I can't talk. We got Gal in a Gal album, that's very cute. Next we have Ray's version. So inside is the same, just gonna move on to the for the book immediately. This arm piece immediately. Wow, that's crazy. This is 
Wait, wow, okay. I'm just amazed by the arm paste she's wearing. That's crazy. In the sideways shot, she has a little bit of white underneath the sideways shot. I don't know why. It's a bit strange. And the group shots. There we go. That was the photo book. And let's do the poster. We got Iso. Okay. Did we get Iso? No, we didn't get Iso yet. So, so far, so good. And for the photo card, we already pulled Ray, I believe. Yes, we already pulled Ray. So, <laughs> let's see. We got Wonyoung. Okay, that's very nice because I do have some Wonyoung claimers in my group order. And speaking about Bon Young, her album is next, so let's go ahead and go through it. So let's go through her photo book. Very cute. Oh, the side. Oh, the hair. Wow. I feel like Wonder always gets very elegant outfits and it really suits her. And the group shots. Wait, she's not wearing the headband here, but she is here. Is she wearing it? Yeah, she's wearing it in all the pictures. Except for the group one. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, she's also not wearing it here. They just decided, let's do it for some pictures, but not for all. So the poster, let's see who we got. We got Ray. Oh, so for the posters so far, we're getting all different members. That is very nice. Very happy about that. And for the photo card, we also got Ray. Okay, so full Ray in a One Young album. Oh, it's actually kind of funny because we got One Young's photo card in Ray's album. And now we have Ray's photo card in One Young's album. That's, that's kind of funny. Uh, we did get a dupe ray though, so that's a bit sad. But I do also have another set of Digipack albums, so I'm hoping that I can pull every member that way. Next we have Liz, so let's go. So let's go through her photo book. Oh, these earrings! What? Oh my god, those are ginormous, wow. Sideways shot. I could never function with nails like that. I would just not be able to do anything, I think. Okay, so let's see the poster, the mini poster. It's Gaul! Did we already get Gaul? I think we already got Gaul. Let me. Yes, we already got Gaul, so this is a dupe, but it's okay. And then for the photo card, I'm really hoping for a Liz photo card, because we haven't pulled her yet. And I really need her photo card, so... We got Iso! Okay. Did we already pull Iso? No, we didn't! It's a new one. Okay, so that's good. This looks a lot like a career to benefit, actually. So that was Liz's album. And last but not least, we have Iso's album. She has the same nails I just saw as Liz. I don't know if they all got the same nails. It just didn't really stand out to me yet. Oh, it's this outfit. So, this is the outfit I thought was- The eye makeup is stunning though. Wow, I love the colors. But I was gonna say, it's the outfit that I thought was quite interesting. With all the belts. I don't know, it's just, also the skirt. It- mm, The ISO looks stunning, but the skirt just looks like a bunched up fabric. I don't know who styled this, but- <laughs> Yeah, she looks stunning wearing it either way, but it's just a bit interesting. So that was her photo book. And then let's go to the poster. So who do we need for the poster? We have Liz, Gao, Ray, and Iso. So we need Wonung and Yujin. So let's hope for those members. Let's see. We got... Oh, we got Yujin! Yay! So it's actually one of the members we needed. That's very nice. And then for the photo card, let's see. We got Iso again. Okay, that's okay. 
we have more albums to open. So this is the ESO album. And that was all for the full unboxing. So I'm just gonna go off camera and open all my albums. And I will go and check back with you and show what my polls were. So I finished unboxing and I laid everything out and sadly there were quite some dupes, especially with the lenticulars. It's crazy. I pulled one Eugene, four Gaul and eight ESO lenticulars. That is just crazy. <laughs> but as you can see, I did pull some dupes, especially with the digibacks. The digibacks were basically all dupes, except for one album where I got a one young poster. Um, but yeah, the rest was all the same, like the photo cards. Also, the Love Life version was pretty sad, but yeah, this is all the pools, and yes. <laughs>